Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Bioshock Infinite. Uh, it's, it's good to be back. I think it hasn't quite been as long between updates this time. As real life is happening and I'm also trying to monetize my YouTube channel. I do apologize if that affects your experience at all, but it's a lot easier to justify doing these videos to my wife if there's at least a potential for some paltry income from it, but there are a whole bunch of issues and apparently copyright law is unclear about Let's Play videos, so I'm trying to figure all that out. I just finished law school and I have no idea whether or not copyright law actually allows for Let's Play videos, so I've resolved that for the moment by rescinding all of my monetization requests, so every video should be ad-free like you're used to for the moment, and I've actually just tried to get in touch with IDOS Montreal and 2K Games and Irrational Games and everybody else who publishes the games I've done Let's Plays for and just asked permission to monetize videos with their content, so we'll see how hearing back from them goes, and in the meantime, it felt like a good idea to do another video. So we are at Raffle Square, and without spoiling too much, peace time is over. Things are going to get started in this chapter. So let's head there. Jeremiah Fink wants you to attend the July 6th raffle. Yeah, we just came through here. Well, let's see what we have here past this big gate. And boy, I tell you, I'm a little nervous. I think my shooting skills aren't going to be up to par <laughs> for 1999 by a shock infinite. It's going to be rough. Here's a purse. Nothing in there. Let's head up these stairs. Nothing here to the right, so let's head to the left. Got a whole street over here. Looks like we've got plenty of barrels to search. This barrel has a sandwich in it, which I'll leave. We have a purse here with two silver eaters in it. Not bad. Columbia Police. Well, that doesn't sound good. And we can actually search this mailbox right here. And get another Silver Eagle. Perfect. Columbia, Monument Island. This way. Police, do not cross. Columbia Police Authority. I'm sorry, son. This street is closed. You best be getting to the raft. You wouldn't want to miss out. Search cutlery box. An orange and a silver eagle. Oh, I guess we'll waste the orange, but it's worth it for the silver eagle. Right over here, we have a searchable basket, which has another silver eagle in it. I'll drink the soda pop, I could use the salt. That appears to be it for this level. Let's head up another set of stairs. Here's a provisions barrel. Empty. Oh, we've got people. We'll see about that. I'm feeling lucky. You always got a feeling. Good night. She's handing out baseball, it looks like. There's another dollar bill vending machine. We have to ignore those, remember. Columbia daily docking schedule, and that appears to be it. For now, let's so head up another set of stairs to a lovely fountain. Trash can search. Two silver eagles. Here, 1912 Columbia Raffle and Fair. Has officially begun! Mister! Mister! Oh, we can't backtrack anymore. 
I don't like where this is going. Wouldn't you like a ball? What does that girl want? We have no choice here but to take a ball. Remember the telegram we received earlier? Sorry, no sale. <laughs> Silly, there's never a charge for the raffle. You've been sleeping under a rock? 77. Do not take number 77. 77. That's a lucky number. Remember? I'll be rooting for Bring you. me the bowl! Is that not the prettiest young white girl in all of Colombia? <laughs> all right then. The winner is number 77! Oh, what do you know? Number 77, come and claim your prize! Here we First go. Throw. Taking your coffee black these days. <laughs> oh, throw it announcer. Like we've got a of course. One here. <laughs> we've got to do something about that. Bitch. Wait. It's him. Now, where'd you get that brand, boy? Don't you know that makes you the backstabbing snake in the grass, false shepherd? And we ain't letting no false shepherd into our flock. <laughs> Show them what we got planned, boys! Awesome. Him. Stop him! The Press B to melee. Is the lead on All right. Fight your way to Monument Island. Come to the police. That pop-up that it skipped a little bit was telling me that whenever a skull icon appears over an enemy, I can hold down V to execute them, which is pretty cool. You got no chance. I see more police up there. The crowd has dispersed. The stage is clear. Let's search the bodies. Can't search him. This one has a silver eagle. This one is empty. This one has three silver eagles. Not bad. Let's head up here. Goodbye. Still here more, but silver eagle and a soda. That one has cake. My health is full, so I'll leave that in case we do get hurt later. Over here to the left, we find the trash can. Empty. Another. Oh, there's Monument Island. It's leaving. And another police vehicle showed up. Achievement progress. Industrial accident. Ten out of twenty. I'm guessing that means executions. You're not so damn tough. Health is full. This one's a gun. And now we have a gun. That's good news. Take the cake. Leave the health kit for now. It recovers 20% of my health, and I'm not missing that much. Let's look at this cart. Oh, my salts are full. That's good. Two silver eagles inside the crate. Oh, it's good to have a gun. This trash can has a silver eagle in it. Alright. This barrel has food and a silver eagle. We're back at full health. Even though we got shot. That's good. Anyone after me right now? playing combat music, but I think I'm safe, so let's pick up this box phone and listen to it. I told you, Comstock, you sell them pack.
paradise and the customers expect cherubs for every chore. <laughs> no menials in God's kingdom. <laughs> well, I have a man in Georgia who leases us as many Negro convicts as you can board. Why, you can say they're simple souls in penance for rising above their station. <laughs> Whatever eases your conscience, I suppose. Now this is a vigor vending machine. They're not only safe to use, even for the achievement, but actually pretty necessary. Pick up the Silver Eagle bag next to it. Let's whack it with possession. Get even more money. Which I actually forgot to do to the dollar bill machine out there. Before the raffle, but I think we'll get another crack at it. Let's head back here and grab that 25 salt. Now, let's go vigor shopping. What do we have here? Possession aid, only $50, adds the ability to possess humans who suicide when the effect expires. That's awesome. We're gonna get it. Sweet. Possession now turns machine and man into allies. Hold and release to create a ghostly trap. Press right mouse to turn machines or people into allies. Hold and release right mouse to create a possession trap. Cool. Search this barrel here. Son of a here. bitch is in the park! Everybody who wants to run up and melee me is gonna be melee. Don't let him escape! It's vitally important to conserve ammo. Okay, we killed those two. There's a turret. Let's try possessing it. That crate is empty. Got a banana in here. Medium file assault. idea. Let's grab this health kit. Boy, is there any other food I left behind? That got ugly fast. These are rotten apples. They actually subtract health if you make the mistake of eating them. So let's not do that. Seriously, what hit me just then? 
I have no idea. Oh, I know that's like one hit away from dying. We got fireworks launchers. Cake and a candy bar. A little bit of extra health. A banana. A little bit more health. Pistol ammo. Alright. 12 pistol ammo in the destroyed turret. That's good. Head down here now. Move forward! The turret has killed a lot of policemen for me, which is good. Three others. We have a Silver Eagle. Hair. Another Silver Eagle. A banana. Here's a pistol. Oh, but my pistol ammo is already full. Now, did I leave any food down here? Because now, all of a sudden, I really need it. Damn, that turret just shredded us. <laughs> Guys with guns, we pretty much have to shoot. We can't try and rush them. That would be suicidal. That's not terribly helpful. Head back into Raffle Square. Got some cotton candy. That's nice. We do get another crack at that dollar bill machine. I'll go ahead and possess it for the Silver Eagles. Oh, believe me, I'd love to find salt. I'd love to find just about anything. I have full pistol ammo, but we are really hurting for pretty much anything else. Chips, a little bit of help. Pear and cotton candy. Whew. Sandwich. Another turret. I know that's what I heard. We're gonna die. No way I no way I take that. Take that out. Yep, there it is. What the When your life is saved, you will be partially healed, but so will your enemies. You will also lose some money. Well I'll tell y'all what, in 1999 mode, that's just utterly unacceptable. Escape Raffle Square. Where did it auto save? Oh, good. Before I murdered myself by screwing up the first turret, that that actually helped a lot. All right, good. Be more careful this time. Significantly so. I told We've heard you, this already. You... From Paradox. I said the customers expect cherubs for every chore. <laughs> no menials in God's kingdom. <laughs> well, 
I have a man in Georgia who leases us as many Negro convicts as you can board. Why, you can say they're simple souls in penance for rising above their station. <laughs> Whatever eases your conscience, I suppose. Basically not get hit. That's just gonna be. Oh. Oh. That's all the that's all the security guards or Columbia police, whatever you want to call them. I do have the other turret to deal with. It's right there. Just gotta find a good place to attack from. A place where I can hit it, but it can't hit me. I'm not really sure where that might be. Well, 
only can do it one shot at a time like this. Just wait for it to give up and leave us alone. That may be what I end up doing. Wait for it to turn away. like health regen and infinite. I don't actually think you're getting a quote-unquote headshot on the turret does any more damage. Two or three more shots. Sorry it's taken so long, folks. I just, I can't really think of a better way to do this. Not when I'm one or two stray bullets away from an untimely demise. I certainly don't want to get greedy. Or impatient. Disaster. The good news about Infinite is that unlike System Shock 2 and Bioshock, it does not have infinite respawn. There are a few specific points where it does, but generally speaking, you can, in fact, wipe out all the enemies and make an area safe. Eat it! Alright. Back to full pistol ammo. It's got more pistol ammo inside. Vial of 25 salts. Let's get the little bits of food we left behind. Anything? I don't think so. Okay, now you'll notice this way is clear and we can head through, but first let's check these police boxes since they're open now. Looks like all they have is some pistol ammo. And we are good as far as that goes. Help kid! Anybody behind me? That's what I'm really on the lookout for. One dude with a club. I don't know if he's gonna come and attack me. I'm gonna kill him with the Kill him with the skyhook. It's gonna be awesome. 
three silver eagles. That help kit gave us a little breathing room, but not as much as I'd like, I'll tell you that. Citizens running away. <laughs> Shady Lane. Take care of the son of a bitch. That doesn't sound good. Patriots Pride Confectionery Candies. We can't go in there. Let's search the bodies of the two I just killed. A silver eagle, pistol bullets, nothing. Let's search up here. Inside the barrel, pineapple. That's good, it's a little bit of help. There's actually an open store over here. No name on it, but it does say come in where open. Almost missed a barrel, but it was empty anyway. Let's head into the store. What's inside here? Oh, it's a storeroom. Let's check the main room first. An orange. A little bit of extra health. Coin purse, two silver eagles, cash register, four silver eagles, and inside the storage room, one, two, three silver eagles, pistol ammo, unknown booze, plus help, minus salt. I'd rather not, because the help is just equivalent to a piece of food, and I only have one cast of possession left. I'd rather hold on to my possession. Oh, this seems ominous. They were shouting about a fireman, so you know something bad's about to happen. Cake in the barrel. A medium pile of salt. Another small health kit. This way to Monument Island. Still closed by order of the Prophet. Apple, candy bar, and pistol ammo. Alright. Looks like that's as good as it gets. Let's go in here and fight the firemen. It's getting hot. What's going on? Vigor from the fireman. Vigor. <laughs> full salt. Hey, an 80% health kit. We're back to full there as well. Beautiful. Let's go back and pick up some pistol ammo. Assuming we can backtrack that far. I think we can. If we can backtrack all the way to the police boxes, we can even leave here with full ammo. That would be delightful. We should see what that vigor does. Relax, Booker. We're going to. Just lamo full. All right. Delightful. Let's go check out the vigor then. Oh, I misread it. It said 90. I thought it said 60. All right. Let's pick up the vigor. Devil's kiss. Yes. Well, you only live once. 
Monument Island and find the girl. Press to throw a fiery grenade. Hold and release to create an explosive trap. <coughs> that wasn't no sample. With Devil's Kiss equipped, press right mouse to throw a fiery grenade. Hold and release right mouse to create an explosive trap. Alright, let's poke around here. Let's try to avoid the fire. We already searched that police box. It had some salt and some pistol ammo. What do I push to switch between figures? Ah, numbers. There we go. Anything anywhere else? Looks like no, but there is a turret up there. Let's possess that turret. Some more policemen. We'll let the turret deal with them while we head back to the lockbox and restock the vault. Looks like he killed all but one policeman. He's gonna bum rush me. Ah, press Q to switch between figures. Delightful. Popcorn and a health kit. The health is full right now, but probably won't be for long if I try to deal with this turret, so... I am gonna have to kill it. That went surprisingly well. Maybe headshots do matter. I shredded that thing. Guess I was just missing the head when I thought quote unquote headshots were irrelevant. Alright. Let's search this street. Not seeing anything. I didn't thoroughly search this balcony, so let's do that now. I believe we're safe. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Columbia Raffle and Fair, 1912. Well, we sure crashed the party, didn't we? There's Monument Island. Still not sure how to get there. Alright, searching this street, I'm not really finding anything. Crates! Nothing. Nothing. Barrel. We probably could have used Devil's Kiss on that oil slick, but possessing the turret did the job just as well. The lockbox with the Silver Eagle and some cereal. Over here is a purse with another Silver Eagle. Pick up salt. Good. Access all your vigors. Hold Q to bring up the bigger menu. Stick with possession for now, it seems more useful to me. Let's head through this gate to the Blue Ribbon Restaurant. There's another lockbox. Coffee, which adds to your salt. Let's search the porch. Not that I really think there's anything out here, but... Ah, I'd be wrong. One, two, three silver eagles. Cigarettes subtract from health, add to salt. Wine does the opposite. Trash can with pineapple in it. The Blue Ribbon Restaurant. Finest quality. Here's the hostess booth. Head, shoulder, back, middle cut, belly, hand. Blue Ribbon Menu. Soup, green turtle, roasts, beef, dish gravy, chicken, French dressing, boiled, boiled fowl, flank of Spanish olives, entrees, minced ham a la russe, vegetables, green corn, boiled ground potatoes, pastry, 
steamed pound pudding brandy sauce. Delicious. Bunch of pistol ammo, bunch of salts, all that's full. We're gonna complete this chapter with full everything. There's some food on this table. Not really anything else going on. Let's head into the restaurant and that's gonna end the chapter. Enter Blue Ribbon. Yes, leave area. Comstock Center rooftops. They had my scent. If I didn't get to the girl soon, this whole job was scotched. There goes the autosave. And we're gonna call that a video. This has been Let's Play Bioshock Infinite. We successfully escaped from Raffle Square and we managed to end the chapter with full health, full salts, and full ammo for our one gun. That's a good way to end anything in 1999 mode. So, next time we will continue our search for the girl, Elizabeth, by going through the Blue Ribbon Restaurant and trying to find our way to Monument Island. Until then, thank you all for watching. Have a great day. Goodbye.